Hello Cancer, welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan, and thank you for being here. It's going to be a general reading so everything may not resonate. Take what does and leave the rest. And for more tarot readings after this, please check out my wife's channel, about 53 Tarot, which is read you as well. Thank you. See what's going on. Jeez, okay. <laughs> you win the lottery, Cancer? Did you win the lottery? That's what that feels like. You won the lottery. It almost seems and feels like... Um, What's that called? Like there was a job opportunity or some sort. It's kind of like there's a sign-on bonus. Um, right away, whatever that financial opportunity is, it leads to automatic just abundance. And it's almost like you're, it's, it's almost even like you're kind of like saying something happened or took place so fast. Even I haven't even had full time to like gather my thoughts and collect myself with what I truly want to do with it. Yeah, lots to contemplate, lots to think about. But overall, you're saying, I may have won the lottery. Um, I'm, I'm very happy, very comfortable, very content. I just have a lot to contemplate, a lot to think about. And I don't want to do anything stupid or rash. I need to kind of like take a step back and really assess things and figure out what I truly want to do. Okay. Wow. Once again, you're saying, you're showing that same energy of I'm comfortable, I'm content, and that's kind of like it's something that's just done with and completed. It's like I've made it, I'm done. Okay. Um, whatever that is, though, you're, you're kind of like saying something is kind of done with. Um, you're wanting to start something new, and that's definitely what you're putting all your time, effort, and energy into. It's almost like you had last minute things to kind of check or go over and then it's like, yeah, it's done with. Hmm. Oh, okay. So whatever this next project or endeavor is, it seems like there's a lot of excitement for it to get started on it. Um, but ultimately you're kind of saying it's just not going the way I thought or wanted it, expected it to. And so I'm a little bit kind of fed up with it. I need a little bit of time to myself. Excuse me, what's going on here, Cancer? I have to say it. There's, I was going to say, I have to say it. There's a little bit of an emotional swing going on. Um, starts off with a lot of positivity. And then it's kind of like, okay, cool. I'm comfortable. I'm good. I'm set. Um, and then it's kind of like, okay, let's keep that momentum going. And then as soon as that happens... It's like something, it's like you're thrown off track with your source. Interesting. You're thrown off track with your source? Yourself, I was going to say. Maybe you have a source. I don't know what that's about. Um, ooh. Mystery. Mystery novel. Um, again, there, there's an energy here of even taking time and taking time and space for yourself. It seems like it feels like it does wonders for you. At the same time, you're kind of like saying, I'm so like, this is, this is interesting, Cancer. If we're go really going in this direction, you're kind of saying that you're disappointed with yourself. Even to the point where you're even kind of like, yeah, I'm over it. I don't care anymore. Like, just very abrupt. Like I said, you start off so happy and excited, and then it's kind of like, yeah, it's fading. What happened there? What goes up must come down. The emotional pendulum. 
Yeah, now, now you're showing me this energy of it's like you're just wanting things to be kind of like leveled. You wanting things to be straightened out, things to be cleared up. And for some reason, it seems and feels like things are, that's what I'm not understanding. It seems like things are being cleared up and straightened out and you are gaining that perspective and clarity. But even then, it's almost like cancer. You're going through this like mental shock about it. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not sure I'm following. It's almost like if things are in the process of being straightened out, that's a good thing. It might be a little bit nerve wracking, but at the same time, you're like, the way you're responding to it is like, uh-oh. It's like, what do you mean, uh-oh? This is a good thing. It may not be perceived that way, but. Hmm. That's why it opened up a can. It opened up a can. Ain't that something? So something was in the process of making itself right. And it opened up a can that you had to work with. You had to kind of shift and kind of move with this. And even then, it's almost like the more that you went along with something, the more problems and issues became to come like come up. It's kind of like um, renovating a house. I want to do this, I want to do that, I want to put a new floor and I want to kind of check the walls, I want to check the attic, I want to check the basement. Before you know it, as you're deconstructing everything and you're ripping the house apart, you find out that the bones are bad, the walls and beams are bad, this needs to be repaired, that needs to be repaired, there's water damage, and all of a sudden, you've opened up a can and now you have all this to take care of, on top of what you currently already taken care of. It all sounded great at the start, but then as soon as you got yourself into it and started it, it became a completely different story. But you are showing me this interesting energy of, even though there's problems and issues here, you're stepping up to be confident to take care of it. So it's almost like um, a little bit of heat and pressure is on. That's twice I've seen this energy today. <laughs> what does he have to say about it? What does he have to say about it? I don't know. I'm going to tell you probably nothing different than you already know. Um, you're showing me, well, let's just kind of see where this goes. And let's do what we can to kind of gain some more information or possibly even seek out a source here. Um, interesting. Did you lose a source? I wonder what that was all about. But of course, if you are dealing with anyone, you could be dealing with an earth sign, an air sign, a fire sign, and possibly a water sign. Bye.